Welcome to the Millionaire Blogging System, Part 7, Day 7. Today is January 31st, the end of the month of 2015 for January. So you've already either made huge advances and improvements in your life during the first 31 days of this year, or you're living on the same circle and go, merry-go-round that you did last year and possibly the years before. Um, it's not too late. You still have 333 days left of this year to make the changes so that you will not end up with a year like you had last year, unless you were happy with last year. Well, let's face it, if you're here, you're probably not that satisfied and you realize that you could actually achieve more, have more, and most of all, if you have a family, you can provide more. Now look, people tell me, well, Bob, you're single, you don't really have a family. Yeah, well, you know, I got three ancient daughters that are in their 40s. But uh, literally, there's a lot of things that I, I like doing, and that's like helping uh, people. And uh, I found out that uh, monetarily, it's cool to like donate bicycles, uh, 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 go to the uh, thrift stores and buy up all their jackets uh, for the homeless brigade that we have. Um, I really can't get out and do it anymore, but you know I can go down and spend a hundred dollars and and buy 10, 15 coats and jackets for uh, the the homeless people and give that to the people that go out during the winter time and uh, give stuff to people. And um, so there there's a lot of things you can do with money. And the whole idea about this is making money. That's why it's called the millionaire blogging system, because it does create millionaires. And we have, with the systems that I'm showing you, we've created over um, 30 millionaires in the last couple of years. So that's, now think about that. That's like a, an average of $1 million earner every month for the last two or three years. So that's pretty good, don't you think? Um, where's your before and after photos, Bob? Well, um, I'm not going to list all the people here. I mean, I could. Uh, I mean, it's no big secret. They're there. They're published. Um, but here's the deal. Um, I've had a bunch of crazy emails, and I always like to confront the, 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 the people that like to send me little, you know, silly comments or, or whatever. And um, here's one of them. Again, somebody says, well, that looks like the same. Are you wearing the same Fight the Forces t-shirt every day? And uh, no, it's not the same one. It looks the same. So as I told the people on the webinar today, I told you I do a small webinar every day for about uh, 30 uh, minutes to an hour. But it's a small group. That way I can have serious accountability with each person. So the only way to be in a group when I start one is you have to be accountable or you're gone. And then if it gets down to where there's nobody's accountable, I close the group off and look for a new one, which I will be talking about. I will be starting a new group. So look, I want to show you something. Now, obviously, I have some of these in the wash that need to be, you know, the dirty clothes basket. So here, um, there's another one. Here's a yellow one. Here's another one. Here's another one. And here's another one. So look, guys, I've got uh, five more days of Fight the Forces uh, t-shirt because it is so relevant Fighting the forces of evil, the, the evil things that are keeping you from realizing your dreams, the things that are causing you to feel so comfortable that you're scared to get out. You know, it's like the kid at the bus stop. He's afraid to go to the bus stop anymore because of the bullies. And uh, so he won't get on the bus and he finds another way to get to school by hitchhiking or something or gets with another kid that's been bullied and rides with them. Um, I bring that back from my school days when uh, we had bullies on the school bus and uh, one of my lifelong friends, I met him because he was being bullied by some jerk off named Steve at the school bus stop. And I'm like I was in third grade, I think. Yeah, I was in third grade because uh, uh, Paul was in sixth. So this this punk bully, Steve, it was pushing you know Paul around and everything and I interfered. So he started getting in my face and I'm like, whatever. But he had a bunch of friends. Now, I'm no genius, and I wasn't no martial arts guy back then. And it's one of the reasons why I tuck up self-defense and so forth is because there are occasions when you do get in a group that you need to have some techniques. You need to know what to do. And then as I grew up, I realized, you know, martial arts wasn't about kicking at people's butts and so forth. It was about discipline 
and controlling the situation. So it's like hardly ever did I ever get in any fights um, after learning, uh, you know, self-control and of the situation and so forth uh, through martial arts and discipline. Because if you control the situation, they back down, even a group of them. So um, martial arts, self-defense is huge for personal uh, safety and confidence. And consider what I'm teaching you to be like martial arts of the marketing and the blogging and income world. So you need tools, you need discipline, you need ideas, and you need training. Wipe on, wipe off. Wipe on, wipe off. Remember that movie? There's a reason. Why am I doing this? Because it has a purpose. It has a purpose. It has a purpose. And when you learn how to do it, if something's coming at you, you can react quickly. But if you don't practice, you're like, ah, you're like this. So learning the tools of how to do something is super important. So with that said, don't make fun of my t-shirts anymore because I love these t-shirts because it's all about fighting the forces of evil. And when people say, what's fight the forces of evil? I give them my business card to the Millionaire Blogging System. Fight the forces of evil that are stopping you from achieving and having everything. Thing that you want in life. Whatever. I'm not reading it for word for word. I don't have my card in front of me. So, today's topic. Guess what we're bouncing back a little bit on because uh, I had actually a few of my friends on Facebook um, that are stay-at-home moms. They used to be waitresses and they know they've had babies and they realize uh, they'd rather stay home with their children. But things are tough. Their husbands have got good jobs or, you know, um, some a couple of them are welfare moms. They don't have a husband or man around, so they're basically just stuck at home. At least they think they're stuck at home. Look, did you ever hear of the um, who was the the lady that wrote the the, the book, the billionaire? Uh, she was a stay-at-home mom on welfare, didn't have a job, and she wanted to get out of that situation, and she started writing books. And she did it like at Starbucks and stuff. And what she would do, because that's where she had wireless, because she didn't have wireless at home. So she would walk her child around until the child got super tired. And then she'd go into Starbucks and the child would sleep at her feet. And then she would write her books while the child was sleeping. Now, that might be child abuse. I don't know. But uh, what is her name? J.K. Rollins or something like that? And uh, but look, she's a billionaire today because she took action. So if you're a stay-at-home mom and you got all these damn excuses about, oh, look, I'm giving you ideas. You can take this. If you're on this, you've got a computer. And even if you know somebody or you just happen to catch this some I, I, way accidentally, you can go to the library. You can go to McDonald's. You can go to Starbucks. You can go to uh, Ralph's Grocery Store where they have Starbucks in there and stuff. And, uh, you know, different find places where they have free Wi-Fi. You don't need internet at home. You can go and use this stuff because you only need a half an hour to an hour a day. And if you want some learning, uh, then you watch your training videos and so forth, or download information, and then do that at home. But you can make your post, create your post, create your ideas, and go to these places and type them in. And like J.K. did, if you got a child, if you got two or three kids, make sure they're super tired. <laughs> and then uh, break off or ask somebody you know uh, get with one of your neighbors get with you people form groups groups and clicks like I said the other day about the the five best friends you have are probably in the same financial situation that you are in other words you are all the average of your total incomes so if you total up all your income and divide it by five that's pretty much your average income and uh, yeah, you might have somebody making twenty thousand. You might have somebody making only ten thousand. And then, but the average is fifteen thousand. So you're within a ballpark range. In other words, you're not going to be broke, and one of your best friends is a millionaire. Okay, because it just—it's very rare, um, unless he becomes your sugar daddy or sugar mama or whatever. So you have friends that hopefully don't want to be in this lifestyle neither that want to be have new cars be able to have your own home be able to have afford to pay for a housekeeper to take care of all the daily chores and maybe a nanny to help with the child and the training and the learning so you still have a little bit of freedom in your life so you can go out and socialize and so forth and then you can exercise and you can have group events and then you can have family group events and so forth for the other uh, stay-at-home moms and uh, you know the, or whatever situation you may be so you can have friends that can become accountability partners to do stuff. Now, again, 
I can't get a disclaimer. Results are not typical. I'm not guaranteed that anybody will do anything or make any money because that's strictly up to you. And I have no clue what your abilities are or really if you're going to get off your damn ass in front of that TV and start uh, doing something to improve your life. It's like if you're overweight and out of shape and just no energy and you're sitting around watching TV and drinking beers or soda pop and eating potato chips or whatever junk food you're eating, what are you doing during the commercials? Stuff in your mouth more so that the noise of crunching doesn't interfere with your soap opera or your late night TV show. You've got two and a half to five minutes per commercial to get up off your damn butt and start working out on the floor, you on your sofa, whatever. There's all kinds of workouts and stuff that you can do. Somebody should start a workout program for TV watchers. Duh. Or get yourself Netflix and then watch TV series at your time without the commercials. Got it? Or watch the shows on one of the internet, like NBC or CBS or something. Watch it on the internet so that you can do your own thing and watch that at your convenience. So, um, stay at home moms. Okay, Bob, I'm staying at home. I don't, I don't know what to do. Well, I'm showing you. Go to my website, themillionaireblogginsystem.com. There's resources there. There's WordPress, like what you may be watching right now. I'm using a WordPress uh, format, and actually, uh, current, with this current video and this current post, originally I used WordPress.com, and uh, I may be using the uh, the Kalatu uh, process uh, with this also. I'm not quite sure just yet, uh, because we're starting a 21-day blogging contest on Monday. So I suggest that anybody listening to this sign up for the uh, the best blogging system in the world right there. It's like seven dollars uh, for the first 30 days. And after that, it's uh, eighteen thousand dollars a month. But you'll be making twenty thousand dollars a month. Results are not typical. <laughs> no, it's it's it, it's like forty five dollars a month after that to have what the basics you need. Okay. Now, seven dollars to get you started for thirty days. But that doesn't mean pay for it and sign up and then wait until the thirtieth day and then go. It doesn't work. No. If you make the commitment to sign up and pay the seven dollars. As soon as you get access, start watching the training videos. There's like eight of them to get started with. Start taking action. Create your first blog the first day. And what's your first blog going to be? Hi, this is Susie Homemaker, and I'm doing my first blog today. And learn how to post a picture. Learn how to post a video. Use your first blog to learn how to do stuff. I let people know I'm learning how to do this, so I'm trying to. I'm learning how to do post pictures and post videos. So people, other beginners like your friends will see that, hey, you had problems too. You just didn't put up a perfect blog the first time, right? Right. Now then, what do I blog about? Anything. Blog about macaroni and cheese. I don't care. But start your blog out. Just start blogging. Do it every day, whether it be with a video or not, with a photo or not. Now, Get your blog started. The Klaatu for $7 is really simple and a lot of great training that I don't need to duplicate. But if you're a self-learner like I am and want to really have the challenge that's like playing games or something with yourself, it's then you can do what I do and just go straight to the WordPress and learn how to do it all on your own. Where you use Google to find out things about, well, how do I do this? How do I do that? You know, and uh, if you're so if you can learn on your own, then do it yourself, but I'm telling you, you will save a lot of time and effort if you get the training from the best blogging system in the world. It's right there about uh, your passion. And if you need products, if you need a, a something to sell to make money while you're blogging about fun stuff, sign up for the, uh, the cash back program. I'm telling you people, this is huge. It is totally huge. Um, if you sign up, you're going to get it. You're going to get cash back from the things you already buy, like at Walmart and Target and Kmart and Sears and Apple computers. Where else can you get a discount or cash back on Apple computers? Yes, this is true. Uh, you can get car parts. Um, you can even get cash back from Groupon. You can go directly to Groupon and get cash back from what you're already getting big advantages from. You can get local restaurants. You can get uh, entertainment. You can get travel discounts uh, from hotels and airlines and cruises and just all kinds of stuff you can do. So um, there's a, just a ton of things that uh, the uh, cashback program will offer you. That's a service 
for everybody else. Become a VIP, and then when you share that with people, you will get $20 for every referral. And I'm telling you, you can promote. Look, if you're a good-looking guy or a good-looking girl, you can use a sexy approach. Put some really pretty pictures up. That will grab people's attention. Notice magazines and grocery stores have pretty people on the cover. 99% of them have pretty girls on the cover. A few of them have muscular guys or famous people. You don't recognize me? I've been in movies. I've been on TV. I've been in the newspaper. You don't recognize me? Whatever. I'm not going to go into my history. So, um, and no, I wasn't on the wall in the post office. They always caught me before they ever had time to put a damn poster up. So, look, you, I know, you probably don't recognize me because of all this, but look, you can do everything. And look, and, and if you're not considered pretty, if you don't think you're pretty, look, just like me, do I look pretty? No. We've got the Santa Claus thing going on, the Viking thing going on, and that's just a, you know, not going to touch on that subject. Uh, separate blogs on those two subjects. But no matter what you are, you can cater to... Look, if you're an ugly old biker, uh, like what I was, uh, then do your blog toward ugly old bikers and biker people. Um, you know, because biker people like to do fun things too. I have crazy biker people as friends on my Facebook page. So there's all kinds of things. So how do I do it? How do I word it? What I, look, I mentioned the other day, you want to make money, you want to be super successful, then look for somebody else that's doing it. Not me, but look for other people. Learn from those who earn. And that's what the best blogging system in the world is all about. The training in there, oh my God, I wish we had this 20 years ago. That is amazing what Mr. David put together and is so outrageous, it's crazy. You get training from people that are successful right now who be have become millionaires in the last two to three years and they show you what they did and what they are doing you're learning from the people that are earning right now not from somebody that come up with a program 20 years ago and he's still selling revisions of that book that's 20 years old or the uh, marketing program is 20 years old or the motivational thing is 20 you're getting training from what is happening right now because what you did with Google two years, three years ago, doesn't work today. Doesn't work. What you did with Facebook a year ago, doesn't work today. It might work a little bit, but it's not as efficient. What you did with Instagram or what you did with Pinterest, doesn't work. There's new things. Things constantly change. I can't get my 8-track to fit into my DVD player. Ugh. So, here's my hint. I'm going to put the link below. It's... Uh, Go to the internet, find the top 10, like if you're, you want to blog about your cats, you're a cat fanatic, and you want to be a cat lady when you grow up, <laughs> um, or cat woman, is that what they call them? I don't know. Uh, so create a blog about cats, but you want help if, as you do that, Google the top 10 cat blogs, or top 10 cat lover blogs. See what they're doing and seeing what they're promoting. And then if you have your cash back program and you're, you're, you, you have um, the VIP, so you're getting referrals, look up stuff on the shopping cart that relate to cats. And then, um, I, let me put that here. I'll put a cat idea product that from cash that you can get from the cash back program underneath here. Now, here's a website that I just uh, typed in before I, I started doing the video. It's the 100 best, most interesting blogs and websites of 2015. Is that pretty cool? So I'm going to put that link right underneath here so you can take a look. And it's categorized um, and so forth so you can get ideas in specific areas. But if, So if you want to come up with some ideas. But if you want a specific information about the blog that you want to start, like cafe owners or like waitresses, what is the top 10 blogs for waitresses? What's the top 10 blogs for doctors? What's the top 10 blogs for gardeners? The subjects that we've kind of like touched over and more that we'll be touching over. Look, I'm excited about what's going on. I'm getting some crazy feedback and I love it. I love it. I love it. And yes, I'll probably wear the same damn shirt tomorrow just because I love this shirt. It gets attention and it speaks what I'm trying to get across. Fight the forces of evil. 
do what you have to do to become successful and watch all my series. Start back at number one if you're brand new. I'm out of here and don't forget to leave comments, send me questions through, leave comments here, go to Facebook, leave me comments, go to YouTube and uh, right here on the bottom of this video, right, right, right here, somewhere right there, right, right, right here. It says YouTube. If you put your cursor over, click on that and you can leave me a comment or question on my YouTube channel too. I check all the social medias that I'm connected with and I answer questions. And look, I'm going to be starting a couple of more small groups, accountability groups, to for different people, um, especially the fitness one. So if you're interested in blogging about fitness, I think we'll touch that maybe tomorrow. Um, then uh, get with me right away because I'm going to start promoting that. I don't want more than maybe 10 or 12 because I want to take a leader out of that 12 and make them what they call like a diamond coach. And I want to make them successful. And I want to do it in 30 days. Boom! Just like that. Boom! Just like that. And I can do it. I've done it before. I've had one of my friends, Randy, tell me after an event, says, Bob, I want to become a diamond coach. You serious? Yeah. Then do whatever I tell you. He became a diamond coach in 21 days. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah. Somebody pat me on the back. It's, it's no big secret. It's no magical tour. It's just, you can do it. Anybody can do it. So I'm out of here. Look forward to number eight tomorrow. The Millionaire Blogging System coming to you in a convenient location. Restaurant, home, bedroom, hotel, on the beach, wherever you might be, you have access to the Millionaire Blogging System to help you Fight the forces of evil. Rock on, rock out.